Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Chroma Squad. In the previous episode we recorded the season 4 finale of Chroma Squad, wherein we made the decision of which storyline we're going to take on. And before I go any further, let me just go on about how the rest of the series is going to work. Basically, I'm going to work from whichever decision came first, in the poll, then second, then third. In this case, we'll be doing the Lone Ranger first, then the Sixth Ranger, and the Metal Ranger as the last storyline. So there's not going to be any more voting on which storyline we're going to tackle. And uh, one piece of advice. If you are going down the Lone Ranger route, do not bother buying equipment from the shop for anyone but your assault. Honestly, it'll just be a waste of money. But without further ado, and I can't really think of anything else to say, let's get on to recording the first episode of Season 5. Kanji Abo's Gift. Kanji Abo visits Geeks United to thank Chrome Squad for saving his daughter. But as always, something goes wrong. Very wrong. Use two skills. Use skills two times. Win five turns. Execute three team attacks. Keep all of your heroes standing. And defeat boss monster with a teamwork attack. Geeks United's bell started to ring. Huh, it must be Tami's father, Kanjiabo. We've been expecting his visit for a couple days. Oddly enough, the others are not here yet. Come right in, this way, Mr. Abo. It's so nice of you to visit us. Too bad my friends ain't here. Thanks for the invitation, Anixia. I'm glad I'm finally at the studio because I wanted to give you a gift. Wow, really? I don't know what to say besides thank you, Kanji Abo. I feel like this is one of those joke scenes where they keep saying a famous character's name over and over again just to hammer home that they're really here. Though I'm not getting the reference at all. I'm sure it's it was some popular series. You didn't have to. Thank you a lot. The gift is outside. Would you wait here just a moment? Sure, why not? A few moments later... Anixia, they're here! What? Who? Lord Gaga kidnapped your friends and ran away! It happened so fast, they were eating some curry rice on the other side of the street and they were ambushed. The minions followed me. They're coming for us. Kanjiabo, get to the dressing room and stand inside. I'll handle these goons. Strange, now it specifically says use square house kick two turns. No matter. Lights, camera, chromatize! That's one down. Now I just have to wait and bide my time until the second. Or until it cools down, which is gonna take one turn. Really? Whatever. The one time I didn't want its cleave time to activate. Oh no, they just keep on coming. There are too many. I cannot give up now. My friends are counting on me. The whole world is counting on me. Need a hand? Too many years have passed since I last said these words. Kanjiabo is here to defend all that is good and battle evil. I am the Night Driver. Whoa. 
Be careful, Anixia. They're everywhere. There are more minions coming. Let's do this, Mr. Abo. Well, may as well start off with this. Yes, with Kanji Abo, we had three abilities. Driver Mode, which means we take 30% more damage, but deal 60% more damage. Defeated enemies can explode, which can create a chain effect. And that lasts for three turns. It's free action, so don't worry about ending your turn taking 30% more damage. Time Gadget, which heals 40% of your health and quote-unquote saves the position of all allies and enemies. Return to these same positions on your next turn, and then we have Driver Kick. Move up to 7 tiles, dealing 150% damage to all enemies on your path. You're gonna want to get used to these enemies. Or these abilities. Be nice if you stopped hitting me. that guy on a critical counter. Don't see that too often. Alright, that's that one down, and we've already hit max audience. Alright, time to enter Battle Fever. Mostly just to get my health back. And now to start wailing on these bread crumblers. Crumblers? Have I just been pronouncing them incorrectly the whole time? Yeah, I have. And you know what? Let's go for this. And miss everybody in the process. Really? I was gonna say square house kick, but that's no longer an option. I'm better off getting next to Kanjiabo. Just cause, you know. Low on health. Doubt I could take down that shell shield as I am. One more turn until. Until it's uh, ready again for me to use as a heal. Hopefully we're down to the point where we're just... Never mind. Ooh, if I get over here... Yeah! Kanji's definitely going to need a heal next turn. Hmm. Too bad the kick isn't available right now, but Anixia's kick is. Unfortunately, he can't launch her far enough. And that right there, what you saw, was basically a time gadget, in effect. Phew, it's been a long time since I last fought like that. You are awesome, Mr. Abo. Where did you learn to fight like that? I once was a very experienced lone hero. It's a family tradition. My dad was also a lone hero. All we had was our bike. 
about the message I sent to you. A few years ago, my daughter had to battle... My daughters had to battle each other because of the Gargans. And whoever won that battle would become their queen. What happened after that is a story for another day. But you see, Tammy already went through too much. Now evil is rising once again, and I have decided to fight by your side. I was wondering where you were, Anixia. Don't you like curry rice? And here you are, along with the great Kanji Abo. Quite a surprise, huh? Killing two stones with one bird? I mean, two stone birds? Mm, never mind. Wait, what? I don't care who you are. But you got yourself in, s in very deep trouble unless you tell me where my friends are. Right now? Far away. Somewhere you pathetic humans couldn't even reach. Alright, now I'm mad. Wow, really? One damage? Alright, who's up for getting out of here? Let's see, Steelix. Armored, high defense, team attacks, and vulnerability are recommended. Yeah, they're recommended, but I can't exactly pull them off right now. How am I supposed to defeat someone that, even with a team attack, I can't... Wait a minute. Those spikes of his cause vulnerability. I just gotta stop him from getting away, or get them to hit him. That should get me out of the way of them. And this should get Anixia out of their way. I mean, they are causing vulnerability, right? Yeah, they are. Nah, I can't get a weapon team attack going. But I can get this going. Now, admittedly, this is actually rather clever. Positioning yourself so that the enemy's attacks hit him. Reducing his defensive capabilities. It's actually rather clever, at least in my personal opinion. Though it does seem like he's catching on. Those two aren't going to hit anyone. Yeah, never mind. Didn't have to worry about any of that anyways. Two... birds. You are not as weak as before, Anixia. I wonder what happened. But this victory will cost you dearly, Pumpkin. 
Kanjiabo, your story ends now. No! What have you done, Lord Gaga? Good night, so long, and thanks for all the shoes, Night Driver. Anixia. I owe you everything for saving my daughter. It was an honor to fight by your side, Anixia. Take my belt. You must carry on our tradition. My bike is also yours. It will always obey the one who wears the belt. Rescue your friends. The world y needs you more than ever. Don't ever forget what you are fighting for. No! Kanjiabo! Don't ever forget. Night Cyclone. Become the Night Driver. Honor the Abo family. Gives you three driver skills. Have I mentioned that Chroma Squad is a great indie show and hugely inspiring? Wow! New gear! Love the new outfit! Outfit hashtag Geeks United. My kid's going crazy over this hero show, shouting lights, camera, chromatize around. Really impressed by the latest episode of Chroma Squad. Yes, now we no longer have our lead, techie, assist, or scout with us. Only our assault. And our weapon has been replaced with the Night Cyclone. Plus 30 attack, plus 40 defense, plus 1 movement, very handy on the assault. Doesn't do any weapon damage, actually, but it does give us the whole Night Driver look. Release date. Come on! When does this game ever is ever releasing? Stop posting food pictures to face album. Release the game. Err, uh, what? I backed this on Kickstarter and I didn't receive a single Kickstarter update. Come on, I threw too many dollar bells at my monitor and I want to play it right now. We are alright. Inixia, we are in space. It looks like a huge spaceship. It's probably Lord Gaga's mothership or something like that. I don't know how long it will take for them to realize that I have guessed their Wi-Fi password, but for now we can communicate safely. They want us to fight each other, promising to set free whoever is victorious. We refused, so they're keeping us locked up. Don't tell Cerebro any of this. I don't want it to be worried. Cerebro was always looking for a way to harness the power of that alien material we got. We'll need it. I'll explain as soon as I come up with a plan. In the meantime, use my scanner for threats. Don't let Lord Gaga's monsters loose on our city. Stay alert for our next message. We're counting on you, Anixia. So, no pressure then. I wonder if the shop's got anything new now that we've got the... Nope. Crafting, maybe? Nope. Darn, I was hoping we could make some upgrades for the Night Cyclone. But, whatever. We can now check out our new agencies. We've got access to... Eagle, a secret Japanese organization of spies who fight against all evil. Extra squad health. More marketing fan power. Armor, which we've already seen. Earth Defense Squad, a united multinational military sponsored by nearly every country. Extra attack, so we know who to go to for attack. Indie Darlings, they just post stuff on microblog and magic happens. Okay, moneygrubber.co, oh wait, eh, yeah, pan conversion rate. Money Grubber Co, if you still have a soul and must monetize it. Lose a lot of fans though, so no. Some Hollywood guys, they want to bring you to the big screen, plus 100% audience per episode. In all honesty, money isn't that big of an issue because we've already reached the end point of what we can get. I mean, granted, I'm going to need it for when we do get our heroes back. Spoiler alert. So, I'm just going to go basically for attack. Hire them out for three episodes. Research alien weakness. Let's see. Research alien technology. So now we are getting a 40% attack bonus from them. Whew. 
And on an assault, that's big. So without further ado, let's get this going. Night Driver. No other episodes available. See, after the passing of Kanji Abo, Anixia realized that reality is as hard as Punkin as Punkpin once said. But there is no time to mourn. Anixia's friends were kidnapped by Lord Gaga, and something must be done. Defeat one enemy in the first turn, defeat four enemies in the same turn. Defeat, defeat. That doesn't tell me much. How does this scanner work? Blizz usually handles this part. Alert, alert. <gasps> alert, alert. I think that's the scanner. How do I make it stop? Alert, alert. Alright, alright, I got it. Just tell me where to go. TV tower. Okay, that wasn't so hard. I hope I can find some clues there. Hmm. I've lost count of how many times I was in the right place before something happened. That's a lot of enemies. Any day now. Gonna stop? Nope. Hey, Anixia! Missing your friends yet? Wait, what? How do you know about my friends? Our bosses are having a lot of fun with them. Tell me where they are, right now, or else. Not a chance we'll say anything. I don't want to see anyone else's tears. I want everyone to smile, so take a good look at... Henshin! Whoa, whose lines were those? Must be this powerful new gear. Guka, is it you? Yikes! Guka? No, I'm Anixia, the new night driver. And I'm going to love this. Now, defeating the four enemies in one turn isn't actually that difficult. Trust me. But we're gonna have to wait for some serious setup. Oh, I'm sorry, was that supposed to hurt? Because I barely felt anything. Come on, everybody get in the line. Which is gonna make it uh, which is gonna be so much easier considering the fact that I'm the only target for them. <laughs> Oh, how nice of you to all gather up around me. But I'm not going for a square house kick. I'm going for driver mode. Yes, that may make me vulnerable, but it also lets me do this. Driver kick! Boom. All but one of them are down. So, yeah. This ain't gonna be too difficult for us. And you know what? I'm just gonna let that little rat come to me. Oh, you wanna hurt me? Too bad. And of course, it's cleave time activates. Finally, we found you. We have waited our entire lives for a real challenge like this. Phew, that stench. Where are my friends, Smelly Donatello? Oh, you mean those weaklings from Chroma Squad? You can't help them. You are all alone. Ha <laughs> ha! There's no one else but me who cannot, who can do this. I believe in myself. I will not forgive you. Shall we play a bit, bro? Yeah, definitely. But of course, you won't do it alone, because you're cowards. Yep, defeat Grimgarl and defeat Sewer Turtle. Hmm. 
Well, they're not bunched up enough for me to do a serious driver kick, so I'm just going to have to get in there and start beating down on some fools. Man, that 40% attack increase is doing new wonders. Oh, these poor fools. They just set themselves up to die. I think. Yep, they did. Really? That missed? Whatever. Square House kick him. Hmm, that's fine. Now, unfortunately, I can't use my axe anymore, but that shouldn't matter. Yeah, and I didn't go after them because I knew the explosion wouldn't kill him. Ooh, definitely gonna need a heal. At well, actually, no, I can get one this turn. Thank you, Battle Fever. One more turn of driver mode, and I'm gonna blow him away with a square house kick. I'm out, it's easy later. And the counter takes him down. Sort of. How could you two powerful must tell Lord Gaga? I won. But I still have no clue of where Chroma Squad is. I hope I'm not running out of time. I will not let you down, friends. Well, that was impressive. Watching Chroma Squad 2, it's addicting. My kid's going crazy over this hero show. Eh, saw that last time. Mate, I have been about Chroma Squad. Fans are loving it around the world. I wish they would use their finishing moves. Well, kinda hard to do when there's only one of us. Ooh, another message. Enlarge your sword. Hello, hello, would you be interested in buying a great upgrade to your sword? Some people might say this is kind of thing is a scam, but who knows? The price is 130, but if you order it now, you get a 10% discount. Are you interested? Sure. I get the feeling we got something similar like this before. But whatever. Oh wait, I didn't read the reply. I knew you were smarter than you look. Your upgrade is all set and ready to use. Thank you. I mean, I'm not going to be using it mainly because... Night Driver. I mean, granted, that is a nice boost, but no. Well, with that, guys, we are pretty much out of time. We've got a minute and a half left, and that's not going to be enough time for Danny thing. Not going to need that. So I'll just take the plus 280 fans per episode. So with that, we will end this episode off here for today a little early. If you guys like what you see, please leave a like, subscribe for future content, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching.